videos not that I've ever done any of these before but I'm so excited to do it I am going to be doing my shoe collection video which I'm so excited about because as you can see back there I have an immense gigantic monstrous collection of shoes I'll go through and show you the clips of every like all of the shoes in it but I'll probably just go through my favorites and I will be trying them on too so just keep watching to see my shoe collection also sorry about this faint sort of noise that you can hear um, my room is like probably negative 10 degrees so I have a heater on right in front of me so I am just gonna be getting started on some of my favorites now these ones that I'm gonna be showing here are all of my favorites from a company named Freebird I used to work there um, and so I acquired quite a bit of shoes um, over my time there quick disclaimer I don't know if that's a, this is a disclaimer but um, the company sucked. I hate that place. They treat people horribly. So the shoes are great. They have a good product and I will never try to undermine that. But the company sucks and I've had some really, really horrible experiences there. So, so the first ones that I'm going to be showing are these. Big. These ones are called Freebird Gold. They are amazing they're sort of just like a clog like a modern clog they look super vintage and then they have like um all these color blocking that's sewn on patches almost freebird shoes are all handmade so this was all hand stitched it's really pretty and they just look so cute with like a simple outfit i always say that these are like a lazy day shoe because you can just throw them on with jeans and a white t-shirt you know and your outfit is like already a thousand times more jazzed up so I love those these are the Bella the Freebird Bella these are the Freebird Bella they are this beautiful aqua blue color with sort of some purple ish tones in them they're really pretty they're like a woven material um they go a little bit above the ankle they're beautiful they're really fun they're unique my next pair is my beloved freebird bond these are the first ones that i fell in love with that were the snakeskin print i'm deeply in love with snakeskin what i really thought was cool about these is that the snakeskin is white as opposed to you know the black and white which i think is really pretty i think that um, it just offers a very, again, unique look, and the straps are so hot. They just look so amazing on. They have a peep toe, obviously, and a wooden block heel, so they look so good in the summer, in the spring, and even in the fall if it's a warm fall. And then finally, in my like short Freebird favorites collection, I have my all time favorites. the freebird joey again they are that white snake skin um like i said earlier i fell in love with the white snake skin on um this pair i showed before but like these are my ultimate favorite ones um they're beautiful they really are the pointy toe is so chic the snake skin is so chic um i love how it even covers the heel which is something that they had just recently done silver hardware is just to die for the only thing that i will have to say about getting this white snake skin i have a few other pairs that have white snake skin as well that i'm not showing right now um it does get super dirty super quick these are my ultimate favorites probably in my whole closet the first ones i wanted to share are these ones they are these charles david just pointed toe tan simple stiletto type heels i love these i'm such a big fan of like nude tan shoes i think especially in heels i 
like more of a tan instead of a black and I just think that these are so chic and simple and elegant and really you can throw them on with like jeans and a white t-shirt and a leather jacket and it's cute or you can throw it on with like your prom dress or your formal dress and it will look good either way that you style it. My next ones are my sock booties. These sock booties are awesome. They're from Ego Official, I think, which is like just an, um, an Instagram shoe boutique, sort of similar to Public Desire and such. Um, they're really awesome. I love them. They go pretty high. They look so cute, especially like, I really like them with a light, um, like loose mom jean, like not maybe a black turtleneck and like a little blazer. I think that would just look amazing but anyways these are a good staple and they look good with anything and they're very chic like once again they are a very chic looking shoe and then finally from this tier i have my new favorite i am obsessed with these i love the detailing of the heel and the heel and the um toe and then i love this like copper hardware right here too i just think that this like i'm not a big fan of flames but i think that these are done really well because i think that's what they're supposed to be you know? and then the crushed silver velvet with like this stretchy material right there just looks so good pointed toe of course i just can't live without a pointed toe and then this heel is really different for me the way that it like sort of diagonals in and angles in it's different but these are so comfortable i just they look so cool on too so these are and i don't know if i mentioned these are from doll's kill um i got them for like 30 or 40 dollars and they're so amazing i'm so glad i got them so so the first ones are okay so these pumas are awesome i really like them um i wear them a lot just like throwing on when i'm wearing something very casual i always feel like they kind of look like jordans which is like so not my style but i do think that they're really cool and they're super comfortable my next pair of tennis shoes i just recently got and i really 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 like these because i've been wanting some like these for so long okay, they are these these are so awesome i love the three velcro like straps on it i've been looking for a velcro a strap sh tennis shoe now a white tennis shoe now for so long and i finally found them throwing them on with an outfit still looks super cute um like leather leggings and like a big knitted um sweater looks super awesome with them and it still makes a really comfortable outfit i have these weird funky odd amazing like insane crazy fabulous shoes they are so cool i got them from shein and i got them for like 15 dollars. one of the shoes has an eye open and one has an eye shut they look adorable on and they're actually really comfortable they're really awesome they look really cute on especially because they sort of slouch a little bit um, again, I wear black jeans all the time, so these look really good with them. It just goes with a lot of things, especially when you don't just want like a plain black over the knee boot. I think that this is a really cool alternative to that. My next ones are... <laughs> these are insane. These I got from Lulu's. Um, I got them quite a while ago now. They were super cheap i'm pretty sure i got them on sale they were like 25 dollars and they're so cute and these are like the definition of a thigh high boot obviously as you can tell they can't even fit in the whole frame the only thing is is they're honestly a little bit uncomfortable and you just want to look really extra these are your boots of course my favorite ones They didn't have those out yet they didn't have a shoe like that so i spent so much time looking for these all throughout the internet obviously something that was affordable because i needed them quick and 
I'm broke, so the only thing again with these ones is they are quite uncomfortable. These are also my babies. Thanks for watching my video. I really appreciate it. I hope that you got some good shoe inspiration. And I know that personally my shoe closet is always, always growing and I'm finding new things that I like to fill it up with. So if you're like me, I hope that some of these shoes um, inspired you a little bit or at least you got some ideas. For me that I've always said is like, if you throw on white jeans and a t-shirt and something super plain, if you put on really bomb shoes, your whole outfit could go from like that to that. But anyways, thank you for watching and I hope to see you in, a in another video shortly. Bye.